Well, colleges here in western New York are seeing a rise in COVID cases. In fact, within the past couple of hours, Mary Alice, UB just updated its COVID-19 dashboard, now showing a current total of 44 cases among its students, with all but just one of them living off campus. And now there's going to be a heightened crackdown on college house parties, which health officials say are largely to blame. Here's two on your sides, Rob Hackford. But if you attended a, a house party in the last week in the UB, Buff State, Canisius, Damon, Duville, you should get tested. Fearful that a spike in coronavirus cases might be bigger than what's showing. That was the county's plea to local college students Wednesday. But what's being done to prevent these gatherings in the first place? Members of the Buffalo Police Department, UB police, go out and proactively look for college parties that are getting out of hand, too loud, too big, and become a safety hazard. We're intervening early. We're taking decisive action uh, if that happens uh, to be able to respond to that so that students understand what the clear message is. Well, Captain Ronaldo says there was almost no activity of concern this past weekend. The assistant vice president of student affairs at Niagara University says there were one or two concerns. To this point, we've not yet had to make a decision to suspend a student from the university, but we certainly are prepared to take that action as we need to make sure that we're underscoring for our students the importance and seriousness behind this. Canisius College is taking a similar approach with educating and warning students first on and off campus. But if a student chooses to host a party, they'll be placed on probation and could also face a $1,000 fine. And similar to Buffalo, Sheffield says Niagara Falls and Lewiston police are also staying proactive because if a COVID cluster does appear, the campus won't solely be impacted. We've got a community of people uh, who may have vulnerabilities for, for various reasons. And that's something that we've tried to appeal uh, to, uh, to our students off campus is that you've got a responsibility that while you may not feel as though you're personally at particularly high risk, you need to be mindful. And keep everyone's health in mind. In Buffalo, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.